Hi, Poopoos. Nest Poopoo and the Pups Turn. Welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, welcome to the Poopoo Stripe. So, this is a unsaid feelings from the person that you are connecting with romantically. Even if you are speaking to this person or not speaking to this person, y'all in separation or whatever. Um, these are just the unsaid feelings that they not telling you that you don't know. Keep in mind, these are general messages. They may or may not resonate. If they do, great. If they don't, you can always... You can always uh, book a personal reading with me to find out what your story is. Um, or you can check out your moon rise and your Venus sign. So, universe, spirits, and guides, what is the unsaid feelings that the person that is connecting with Pisces? The person that is also still connected to Pisces energy. What are some unsaid feelings? They have for Pisces that they are not saying that they do what, what Pisces don't know. Okay. Whoa. Unrequited love. To your person feel like y'all is not on the same page. We have wedding. Some of you guys, your person feel like that you're married. Or they just view you as this, okay, engagement. So your person want some type of, um, you can pull it down. Zip it down. So uh, your person could feel like that they want some type of like higher commitment. But they feel like that's not happening right now. With the unrequited love. Wow. So tell me more. Tell me more. You guys be connected with Aquarius or Aries authority, emotional withdrawal, and rest and rejuvenate. So your person feel like that they just need to take some they need to take some time to themselves. They need to pull their energy back so they can take more control of their emotions. Wow. I mean, they see that this is still, it's still some light there, but your person feel like that they just needed to like pull their energy back. Tell me more, please. Yeah, they feel like that y'all needed a break. So they needed to cut this out so they can go ahead and focus on themselves and their own uh, fulfillments. And in due time, then they feel like you guys can come back together with some type of offer. So your person got their guards up with the nine of wands. Told you. They have their guard up because they feel like you guys need a break with the four swords. They came right back out. They look at you like marriage material. Yeah. They feel like that this can work or they just focusing like on their finances. Or they just focusing on work so they can go ahead and not really think about this break that y'all on. Or this non-communication. Yeah. So your person, they kind of like being patient. But at the same time, they feel like in divine time, they y'all will, I guess, come back together or heal this. King of Wands. Yeah. Uh, 
Ace of Swords. They feel like they already received a, some type of like clarity or um, they do want communication though. I'm not gonna lie about that. They want to take some type of, you can have a family with this person. If you don't, they want to take some type of leap of faith towards their happiness. They confuse seven of cups, so. so it's like, yeah. Hermit in reverse. Some of y'all could be dealing with a Virgo but, or a Aries, like I said, Sagittarius. Four of cups. This person feel like either you reject them, or some of y'all could be connected with a Libra, but. They could feel like kind of bored in this connection right now. Or they just being like super stubborn so they can get more balance. Yeah. I'm telling this person could be really focused on their finances. Really focused. This could be like some type of boss to like some type of business person. But they also could feel like sometimes you, you like to like control the situation just a little bit too much. And they could be like feeling like mentally stuck a little bit when it comes to you yeah so this person is coming off really really cold okay, I wanted to come out page of swords page of wands knight of pentacles page of pentacles so this person feel like <sighs> this person can feel like you watching them as well but they can also feel like like you got some type of immaturity about you when it comes to the connection. They could also feel like you some type of player just for uh sex as well. With the ace of wands. Yeah. But then at the same time, see this is why they confused because they feel like you could you a wish fulfillment too. person feel like you they person though because we got the king of swords that came out as well so they feel like they needed to cut this off y'all could have had like some type of argument because or like some type of disagreement yeah this person feels like they're your person because once again well they could just feel like you have um multiple people multiple options they can feel like that you vibing, like you you kind of like vibing with somebody else. Not for everybody. Others of y'all, they just feel like focusing on finances. I mean, they it's focused on finances. So they made some type of decision. Yeah, this person is focused on finances. Real talk. Uh, some of y'all, this person made a decision after they found out about a third party. Yeah, y'all could have had some type of communication. But this person wants to communicate. I'm not going to lie. Some of y'all could be dealing with a cancer. But this person want to come towards you. This person feelings is like, what? So I feel like this person is like kind of closed off emotionally. But deep down inside, yeah, they being quiet. They sitting up his, they staying quiet with the high priestess. They not really communicating like that. This person is waiting on you to communicate though. I'm telling this person focus on their finances. With the nine of pentacles. What advice do you have for Pisces when it comes to this unsaid feelings of their person? Pisces needs you know what do Pisces need to do about this situation. To okay, so we got full moon in Pisces, balance spirituality and practicality. I'm coming. Then we got it's time to take action. Let you work. 
Um, so it's telling you it's time to take action, but you guys need to balance out um your spiritual side and also your practical side. Maybe you you and this person could get more balanced and get on the same page because this person look at you like you could definitely be a perfect match for them, but they feel like it's some adjustments that's needed. Okay. So that's all the messages that I have for you guys. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to the channel. If you'd like to book a personal reading with me, everything is down in the description box below. Other than that, I love you guys, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye, peoples.